Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 cutty, black with the purple strip. Damn, it's your boy Raven C. Now, Tucker, that's all I got to say. Y'all already know what that is. All right, that was a nail biter. That was a nail. It had, it had no business being a nail biter. But we're going we're we're going to discuss that in a second. Okay, so let's look at some stats. Get straight to the details now. Right off the bat, defense. They could been getting roasted since week two, but they came out and played they butt off this game. Joe Burrow. As they used to call him 500 Joe, he wasn't 500 Joe in this game. 217 yards. One TD, one interception. Got sacked twice. They'll, you should have got sacked more than that. But that 217 yards, that was nice. And that one interception, we know who that was. That was... No longer Stone Hands PQ. He caught it. This, he he dropped it twice. Dropped one. And I believe it was the Patriots. Dropped one at the Bills. But this one he redeemed himself. And that and we're here. What a good time to redeem yourself going against the Bengals and helping us win. Okay, then uh, we're going to rushing. They kept talking about Joe Mixon. Uh, uh, he got 78 yards, but we all know we they, we wasn't concentrating on that. We wasn't concentrating really on the rushing game. Even though they said in the game he was averaging like 5.8 or something like that. But we know Joe Burrow, he likes to lunch that thing. And obviously, as I said on the stats, he wasn't really lunching that thing. Then Hayden Hurst, six receptions, seven targets, 53 yards. He got that one TD. He was waving at the crowd. Hey, y'all remember me? Now we don't remember you because we got Mandrews. He took your spot. After that, he really didn't do that much. He got, I believe, gave him, a, I think, one more extra first down because he trying to get a Marcus Peters face. And I'm like, dude, you, you you don't want that smoke. That that's Marcus Peters. Like, come on, Jamar Chase. That twelve targets for Jamar Chase, seven receptions, fifty yards. And what I was looking forward to, it actually happened. He was on Marlon. Marlon was his. Marlon was punking that man like he punked o, Odell Beckham when Odell Beckham was with the Browns. He was just punking that man. He's like, this ain't the same as last year, partner. You did all that smack talking all season. Now it's time to man up. Couldn't do nothing. T. Higgins, ankle injury, he was out. I know some people are going to say, y'all only won because T. Higgins was out. Nah, win is win. Shut up. Okay, next one. They defense, I don't even, guess I ain't going to talk about their defense. Let's get to the real team, the winners. Lamar Jackson, 174 yards, one TD, one interception. He got sacked one time. Now, that interception, that was all on him. He overthrew it. But, in my honest opinion, Lamar played like trash. Trash. He literally had Dev for a bomb. He let it fly, but he let it fly a little bit too much. Missed him. Then on the fourth, he told Hobbs, I got this on the fourth. And they it, it kind of made it look like they put the camera on, on Lamar. Lamar was doing a, I got this, I got this. And I'm like, all right, it's fourth and two now. Hobbs looking like, man, they done killed me all week. Lamar, wide, it's wide open. Missed him. And I'm like, oh, Lord, here we go. Hawes was looking like, man, you about to cost me my job. You saved my job in 2018, but now you're about to cost me my job. But rushing, Lamar, 12 carries, 58 yards. 
And mainly he really got them, the main them yards really came in the last of it. J.K. Dobbins, eight carries, 44 yards. Kenyon Drake, Drake, he actually did pretty good. He actually did pretty good. Then Devin DuVernay, they trying to use him as Debo Samuel. But he did all right. But one thing I couldn't stand was the inconsistency. I think I said that right. If I did, I did. Woohoo. Um, that we was killing them in the run game. Like everybody was saying, run the ball, run the ball. It's like Greg Roman was so determined to throw. But I don't know. But we still won it. We still won it. Mandrews. Now, when they was throwing it, Mandrews started cooking them in that second half. I don't know what the Bengals was thinking. He was, man, man, he was killing them. Ten targets, eight receptions. Killing them. You, I thought he had 100 yards. He only had 89. Phew, how he was manhandling them boys. Killing it. Devin Duvernay, five receptions, 54 yards. Now, if he, if Lamar would have caught that, they probably would have been around 130. Something like that. But D. Rob had one. Oh, Wallace actually had a catch. Well, I forgot about that. Look at that. Oh, Proche actually had a catch. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Wow. Then Isaiah Likely, supposed to be the savior. Yeah, he. he mm, mm. Yeah. Two receptions, seven yards. So, mm, you know, they said Landon Bond fumbled. I don't remember that. I don't remember letting the ball fumble. That's a question. Oh, look at look who led the team. PQ, the interception man. He played to me, he played pretty good. He got done in on just a little bit of plays, but it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad like the mother game. But he did good. Clark, Peters, Mark, me and my boy Marcus Peters. He was man, he was punking that old Jamar Chase. Jamar Chase looked like he got his lunch money too. Gonna cry in the car. But overall, the defense really did good. From top to bottom, they did good. Then, the savior of the day, Justin Tucker. Four for four, 100. That, that boy's on A on a row. They should give that man a trophy of A on a row because he was just clutch. Longest one was 58 yards. Easy. Easy. He was just killing it. I know they showed the points on here. That's cool. 13 points he gave us. 13 points. Killing it. Mainly on the game winner. I was like, oh, you know, I was nervous a little bit. But really, I was nervous of uh, Jordan Stout. Because I was like, this is his first time holding the ball for Justin Tucker on a game winner. Because we know Sam, Sam, easy. But Stroud, that was his first one. I was like, man, don't you bobble this ball, young man. You don't mess up Justin Tucker's record. But he did good. He got the record. Easy, easy. I can't believe the Bengals gave up that much time on the clock. But overall, um, defense, phenomenal. Hopefully they can continue this. This is just the first step because the next week we have um, Giants. And Giants actually have been winning. I believe they are 4-1 because they beat that bad man Aaron Rodgers today. But defense was just, man, they really, really played good. Brandon Stevens. Didn't hear his name. No mess up. Unfortunately, um, Marcus Williams hurt his wrist. Hopefully they'll let us know if that's serious or not because that is our interception machine. And I actually thought he was going to get an interception in this game until they said he was out. Then they put Geno um, and Clark back there, and they played it safe. But they played a lot, a lot of zone. So I know the Bengals and other teams is going to be looking at that because that zone really helped out. I was surprised. And the Ravens is really not a zone team. They're a man-to-man. And the Bengals kept trying to do their little screen pass. And they, even at the beginning of the game, they 
back to back passes to Chase. Like Chase killed us last year, and this thing it still seems like they was living off that. I you should say. Like yeah, he got us last year, but that come on that last year they we was so banged up we was playing with garbage man cafeteria people everybody just, people just off the street just throwing giving them a jersey and say go out there and play. Cause I was like, why they keep doing screen passes to Jamal Chase? And I was like, oh, they just trying to rub it in our face, but it didn't happen. Cause really we supposed to win way more than this. Lamar missed 14 points on the left, 14 points on the field, as they say. And that would have been a huge, huge difference. But next time we see him, I believe it's week 18 or something like that. So that's that's a good minute. That is going to be a good minute before we see them again. But tell me what y'all thought about the game. I loved it. Lamar played like trash. Hopefully he fixed that. Because that man, he was overthrowing. I know they're going to. And they're going to. Lamar knows they're going to sit there and nitpick his game, boy, because his accuracy was terrible on them two plays. Boy, he, then he started like, man, I'm messing up throwing this ball like this. Let me go to my, let me go to my, my security. Start, man, Drew, start cooking them. Man, Drew looking at the hearse like, yeah, you, you, that's, that's why you left, partner. That's why you got traded because I'm that dude. Well, her sitting there talking about waving all that like he's just that dude. Anyway, hopefully y'all enjoyed the game. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that share. Everybody stay safe. And once again, Tucker!